Damon here with IGN News. It took 25 years to happen, but The Simpsons are coming to cable by way of FXX. FXX has acquired the entire Simpsons library and is going to start in a massive way, with a marathon of all 552 episodes that have aired from 1989 until now. The marathon will begin on August 21st and will conclude 11 days later on September 1st. And yes, it will include The Simpsons movie airing in its proper spot in between season 18 and season 19. Beginning September 2nd, FXX will then begin regularly airing The Simpsons several times a day. There will also be mini marathons every Sunday beginning at 4 p.m. that lead into the 8 p.m. broadcast of the show on Fox. These marathons will be tied into new episodes, such as airing several Krusty the Clown episodes the day a new Krusty episode will make its debut. Then in October, the new Simpsons World app will launch. We were given a demonstration of it today, and it looks very, very detailed and impressive. Simpsons executive producer Al Jean joked, I don't want to overpromise, but I do think this app will provide you with affordable health care. First and foremost, it will have every single episode of the show available at any time. A randomizer will play a random episode for you. There's also a counter keeping track of how many of the 552 episodes you've watched so far and sections devoted to specifics like collecting all the chalkboard gags. The title comes from a book Matt Groening did for the show's 20th anniversary, and like that book, the app will provide detailed information on the show's episodes and characters. The rub is you will need to be authenticated as an FXX subscriber, and FXX is only available from 60% of cable providers in the U.S. currently. Executives stress they are working hard to change that in the next year. For more, stay tuned to IGN. Want even more breaking news? Subscribe to our brand new channel, IGN News. We'll bring you updates on everything happening in video games, movies, TV, and tech all day, every day. Subscribe at youtube.com slash IGN News.